Hey everybody, I want to share a new book that we just got um, with you uh, called Dreamers. I want to read you a little bit about uh, what the story is kind of about. It says, what if you dreamed of a new life and it came to you? What if that new life led you to a new country where no one spoke your language, where you felt alone and ignored? What if you had to make the new place your home? What if you found that home in a world of books? And what if it were all true? Dreamers by Yui Morales. I dreamed of you, then you appeared. Together, we became resplendent life, you and I. Resplendent. That's an interesting word. I actually had to look that word up before I read this book. It means like beautiful, colorful, vibrant, exciting life. Really pretty illustrations. One day, we bundled gifts in our backpacks and crossed a bridge outstretched like the universe. And when we made it to the other side, thirsty and all, unable to go back, we became immigrants. Migrantes, you and I. The sky and the land welcomed us in words unlike those of our ancestors. You can see in the sky the clouds, they actually form some words. It says, what? Say something. Speak English. These are a lot of the things they are probably hearing when they didn't speak their language when they came there. There were so many things we didn't know, unable to understand and afraid to speak. We made lots of mistakes. Imagine coming to a new country where you don't speak the language that everyone else speaks and they don't speak the language that you speak. It'd be pretty difficult to figure out how to do really simple things, even going to the grocery store or ordering food. It says they made a lot of mistakes. If you check out this picture here, that might seem kind of silly to us. They're kind of playing in the water or bathing in the water. That might be something they would do in a different country. But here, obviously it's something they're not supposed to do because there's a police officer, but maybe they didn't know that because they're not from here. <clears throat> you and I became caminantes. Thousands and thousands of steps we took around this land until the day we found A place we had never seen before. Suspicious. Improbable. Hmm. What did they discover? Unbelievable and surprising. Unimaginable. It almost seems like all of these books that they're following in, following in love with are coming to life. I see a shark and a rocket ship and a fire truck and a baseball and other kinds of fish and a dog and a guitar, all kinds of things. Interesting. Do you guys ever feel that way when you're reading a book? You can see things come into life. Where we didn't need to speak, we only needed to trust, and we did. Books became our language. Books became our home. Books became our lives. We learned to read. To speak, to write and to make our voices heard. I think it's really interesting how in the beginning of the story, when they first came to this new country, that they struggled to understand and speak the language and understand it, and through this love of books that they discovered, they're starting to learn those things and teach themselves. Someday we will become something we haven't even yet imagined. 
but right now we are stories. We are two languages. We are Luca. We are resilience. We are hope. We are dreamers. Sonadores of the world. That means like dreamers, explorers. We are love, amor. I hope you guys enjoyed the story. Um, I think it's a very relatable story, a very interesting story how a love for reading and a love for books allowed a family who was new to a country who didn't speak a certain language to immerse themselves in that culture and learn how to read and to speak and to write in a different language, but also being comfortable and still celebrating who they were. And that's really important. So I hope you guys enjoyed the book, Dreamers.